Hi everybody, God bless you. Hey, hey, hey everybody. Hi believers, hi worshipers. How are you doing? I want to welcome you especially again to the year 2021. This is the year that the Lord had ordained to reveal what I call restoration. This year, the Lord will be your restoration. The Lord has proposed to be our restoration this year. And um, it means that you are about to experience rest in areas where you have been tossed and turned and been um, discomforted. The Lord is about to speak comfort to those comfortless places. And um, I just feel like I should come on here today to pray. Um, I don't know if I have actually just set out to pray, um, to join my faith with yours, to speak words of life over you. But today I just feel it that I'm going to come here and pray for somebody. And um, for me as well, I guess. But I feel like we need to pray. And so it's okay to take this few moments, a few minutes, if you've clicked on this video, to pray. Father, we're here in your presence. Lord, I am standing at the throne room, at the grace throne, at the throne of grace and of mercy. And I bring along with me these ones that are listening to the sound of my voice. I bring along with me this ones that are watching and hearing and praying along with me right now. God, you said in your word, is there anything too hard for you to do? Absolutely nothing. You said in Ephesians chapter 3 and 20, that now unto him who is able to do exceeding abundantly more than we can ask or think through the power that worketh in us. Now, 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 now. God, we know that you are a God of even the now. And Lord, we have come just as we are. Our situations are different. And you know exactly where to meet us at the point of our needs. Some of us are like Israel, the Israelites at the Red Sea. Looking back at the Egyptians coming forward with the horses and their chariots and looking in front of us is a mighty Red Sea. Some of us are like Zechariah. Some of us are like Anna at that Shiloh, at that place of groaning and heaviness of heart. Some of us are like Jacob we are wondering for that encounter that would change our lives. Some of us are like Joseph in the prison of life, waiting for a dream that was given years ago in the prison of life, serving you in the prison of life, waiting on you, going from one kind of season to another season, waiting for the manifestation of a dream that was given years ago. Many of us are like Moses, running from our past. Oh, Some of us are like David, trying to live a life that would please you and be full of your praise. Lord, I don't know where we are right now. I don't know who is listening right now. Some of us are probably like Abraham. <laughs> we are being tested and being tried on every side. But you, O oh God, remain at God. You're the everlasting, the eternal, the only wise, the only able, the only wise, the only wise God. I pray for your people right now that are going through mind battles, physical battles, spiritual battles, emotional battles right now. God, they're going through marital, financial, going through spiritual, academic. They're going through all sorts of battles 
because of what you have proposed for them. Lord, I bring you right now into this situation. Lord, do not stay at the surface level. We are calling you down to the depth of it, that you will come down to the root of it. For you, O oh God, are deeper than the deepest sea. You are higher than the highest mountains. You are wider than the heavens. You are wider than the earth. Lord, we bring you into those situations right now. And we ask for the restoration anointing. For the rest anointing. For the comfort and anointing. In the name of Jesus, we call for everything that has been stolen. Oh my God, you are the God that restored David. You restored him and you can still restore right now. You are the one that restored wasted years and time that have been wasted. You are the God of restoration. We are asking, Lord God Almighty, that you will be unto this ones, that you will be even unto us, our restoration. Come and be our restoration. Thou God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, come and be our restoration. When you become our restoration, we lose nothing. We lose nothing. We lose nothing. Oh, because to gain you is to gain everything. Be unto us our restoration. In this year, be unto us our restoration. In this month, be unto us our restoration. Even right now, because now you can still do it. Even now, 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 we have faith now. We have faith now and we know you can do it now. Rise up, rise up, rise up and restore. Rise up and speak peace. Speak, oh God, an answer of peace, an answer of restoration, an answer of healing, an answer of deliverance, of liberation, of promotion, of a change, of an encounter, oh God, to your people. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. God bless you. I pray that God who answers prayers will answer you now.